$15 to Netflix, seven to Spotify, another eight to Disney Plus if you don't bundle it all together. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't <laughs> seem like a lot of money separately, but together it really oh, does add up. Yeah, it does. And of course, in a time when everyone is asking where's the money, streaming services might be the first on the cutting block, but what if you still want to watch TV without having to pay for cable? Oh, that's a great question. WCNC Charlotte's Nick Sturdivant thankfully joins us with some free streaming content. Yeah, we all love our streaming services. How else would we be able to creep, keep up with the Love is Blind crew? But we don't love how much we're paying each month. Now, a survey from Banjo, an enterprise software provider, found a typical consumer spends nearly $1,000 per year on streaming services subscriptions. If you break down that, that's about $80 a month. And Consumer Affairs says these costs will only go up in the future. And now if you're looking to ditch some of these services, there's tons of free content available. You'll just have to watch commercials. For example, Roku Channel is a free streaming service provided by Roku. It offers a wide selection of content, including hundreds of live TV channels, movies and TV shows. There's also Pluto TV, which provides a mix of live and on-demand content, including movies and TV shows. And if you're looking for original content, you might want to check out Crackle. It's known for its original content, Klax's shows, and, and a variety of movies. Consumer Affairs says subscription services aren't the only thing weighing down your budget. They say a, a lot of people often sign up for credit monitoring and other services and then forget about them. So next time you check your bank statement, double check to make sure you're not paying for a service you're simply not using. All right, good stuff. And tonight on WCNC Plus, another free streaming uh, opportunity or option for you, I should say. We share more tips you can use to this spring to get your finances in order from budgeting to spending and investing. Now's the time, right? Watch your latest uh, Your Money episode at 830 on your preferred streaming device. And as Brad pointed out, 